What? He's ripping his face apart! He's ripping his face apart! Oh. Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So today we are jumping into episode 77 of Attack on Titan, the second part of the final season. Yeah, so the last episode kind of left me in like a daze because I feel like it's just been so long and I was just really like trying to soak in like what was happening after that last battle um, with Levi, um, if he was like dead or just injured, um, Zeke just nearly dying and then he just rejuvenated his whole body just like walked out and was like yeah so like what's up and i'm just like okay <laughs> this is a lot going on so let's jump right in all right let's go Okay, so it's given us a recap of what happened last episode when they're like, Mikasa, you want to help? I'm like, of course she wants to help. But then she thinks she's just being controlled by her blood. But the others theorize that um, that Aaron lied. And I kind of feel like he lied too. I do, but I'm not sure. They're like, what? You actually believe that story? They're so funny. It was so funny when she was like, I do get headaches from now and from time to time. I'm like, yeah, like, don't we all get headaches? <laughs> right, and then Armin explains how like they, he thinks that Aaron is just pretending to go along with the plan so that he didn't have any of them opposing him um, because he controls the Titan regardless if he goes with Yelena or not. And I mean, or with them. And so it plays out better for everyone if he goes along with the, the bad guys to like, to like essentially protect everybody. Yeah. And so... I don't know. Armin is being very optimistic. I don't know. He's like, can we leave now? It's so cool. That's funny. He don't want him to die yet. <sighs> I can't slug him in the face. Literally. Like, we can't get our revenge if he dies now. Because if he, if he hides his intentions and pushes them away, it protects them, essentially. Because if they're not working directly with him, then they're not in harm's way, right? So if it seems like they're going against him and then he controls, you know, what happens to them, then it protects them, I guess. Oh, wow. This is rough to watch. That's so sad. Like, watching them grow from being so innocent to being, like, destroyed over these years is, like, crazy. Mm-hmm. I hope so, but I don't know. I feel like somebody's not going to make it out of here. Show that one again. 
I remember in the last uh, reaction, I was saying that I wasn't sure if Aaron was even in this body because of the Warhammer. You know how the Warhammer can, was like underground and controlling the body above ground with those powers. I wonder if he's even in there. You know, because they stabbed him through the head and they woo! Oh, he's using his Warhammer powers, yeah. I don't know, because they're not showing him inside the body, and so it's throwing me off. And what do you mean what he's fighting for? He literally has to protect his people. Like, come on. Oh! That was rough. I'm sorry, Galliard. Galliard. <laughs> he cut his face. Yeah, his face was just smashed in. Seriously, they really jumping my boy Aaron. You want this to end now. Oh, he's going to try to bite. He's going to try. Oh, he's going to try to eat him. Oh, there's him. <gasps> so he is in there. He is in there. Okay. What? He's ripping his face apart. He's ripping his face apart. Oh. Ah! His face. He ripped the sh from the mouth up. Okay, so my theory was <laughs> Okay, my theory was this was not right. He is inside the body, but they just I guess they just haven't hit him. Oh, the beast titan? Right? The beast? Yeah. Don't you say things like that. That is weird. That's weird. I had to bring Rimuru out because who that last that last scene just I'm shook. Okay, this episode is called Sneak Attack. And Zeke just showed up. And he said, leave the rest to your big brother. <laughs> what? Stop. Stop. I truly cannot, guys. I can't. He throwing rocks at the, 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 um, what do they call them again? Airships, I think they call them in this. Cute. Oh, oh, Big is almost a victim. He was almost a victim. I mean, she was almost a victim. Oh, they coming. They coming. I love the sound with the uh, strings coming in. <laughs> I love it. Love to see it. I love to hear it. Aaron is literally f hanging on by a thread. He limping. His head been been shot twice. He's been stabbed through the core. Gabby thinks she about to do. We gotta stop him. Gabby, what? What, what are you doing? What, what are you gonna do? Yeah. Now you don't want to run off on your own. Oh, it's, um,
the youngest. Team is back. I rolled with a bear. That means he's not feeling good. <laughs> mm, so he drank. The wine, too. Guess so. Oh, okay. Why is she leaving the scarf behind? I feel like she's trying to determine whether it's her own will that loves Aaron and wants to protect him or if it's her blood, like he said. I feel like she's still very confused. Is that Yelena? Oh, that's the scene we saw at the end of the last episode. So they're on fire from Zeke throwing rocks at him. I was wondering. Sheesh! I would hate to be on one of those. Why is Yelena sitting... What, what, what is it that you're doing? What? I feel like Yelena thinks she's God. At the, or she or he, they, I don't know. They... Aaron is... Where is Aaron going? He just started walking towards... Z. Oh, he threw. Ah, he's done. Huh. I'm gonna say I'm gonna I'm gonna give another motivating speech. It's okay. I'm gonna give another speech. <laughs> what the? What is wrong with that child? I'm shook. So Aaron is limping towards Zeke right now. And Zeke is fending off. Gabby, I don't know what the hell Gabby doing. I think she's trying to go get um Falco. Oh, there he is. He's not going to say anything. Oh, he did. Oh, he's gonna let him go. He's gonna free him and send him back to Marley. But I don't think Falco wants to... I forget how Falco was feeling at the end of last... Of part one. I feel like Falco was like, all of this is a mess. Hope he survives. What did you trust in me? 
because she realized that they're not bad people. They're literally just human, just like her. And like, I don't understand like how, I mean, I guess we understand, right? They're all brainwashed and stupid. Oh, yeah, that's the girl that's, that won't forgive her. But the rest of them was the family that that forgave her, you know, even up to sh what she did. I'm glad that Gabby is growing, like, a sense of, like, a consciousness, right? They were just people, exactly. I just said that, I just said that. They were literally, they're all just people just like them living their lives and they came in and did, tried to destroy them for no reason. Well, for reasons that nobody even knew until they started trying to destroy them. Stupid. It's insanity. They're just repeating this cycle over and over again. These people. He didn't know. Damn, so he think he about to die. He think he about to die. He's like, I'm gonna confess everything because we about to die. Stop, because if they die, I'm literally gonna die myself after he just confessed his feelings. Ah, Gary shook, his brother shook. Because <laughs> he think he about to die. They not know. I forget what the black band meant. What did the black band mean again? Oh, the black man meant that they drank the spinal fluid, I think. Oh, man. I can't, I'll never get over the fact that him throwing rocks are like freaking rockets. The fact that they're spending so much time concentrated on Aaron walking. The cart titan. Oh. Did Pew, did they get him? She pretended, they pretended to be dead to lure them in. Oh, 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 the sneak attack. That was, I mean, it looked like it hit his shoulder, but it's like right here, but it looked like it hit here. Oh, shit. So this was the sneak attack. She was pretending that she was, she pretended that she died on the wall to get a perfect shot at, um... I guess Aaron or Zeke, because I guess they didn't know that Zeke was sh gonna show up. They might have, like, guessed. What do you mean Aaron shouldn't have the problem? Like, like, 
Come on now, Reiner. They said he'll scream. Because he's fatally injured. And Falco is going in closer to him. So, like, the closer that you are to them, the closer that you are, it's, like, more likely that you'll turn, right? You have to be within, like, a, a ears. Like, you have to be able to hear the scream, I think. I'm not sure. I just remember that last time he screamed, the people back in the town did not turn, but the people near him turned. And so, Falco's getting closer to him. And since he's fatally wounded, they think that Zeke will scream to like save his life, right? Because he needs to, he needs backup, right? <sighs> this is ah oh god, ah oh, this is not. Let's watch the preview. Screaming when he injured, <laughs> I'll be so sick. Beast in the valley, right? Two brothers, Zeke and Aaron. Aaron Yeager. Oh, so there was so much to unpack in this episode. And I'm just like, okay, so Zeke and Aaron are both there now. Reiner, pretty much out for the count. I don't know if he's recovering, like, currently, because it did show a snippet of him, but he was kind of, like, ducked down. I don't know if he was laying down on the ground or what. Um, Reiner is getting worked right he did bop 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 from the brother soon as soon as zeke showed up he was like oh leave it to your big brother and i was just like oh this is too much right and so i right now what we're worried about is if falco is going to change into a titan he just confessed all of his secrets that he sent the letters to aaron that he is in love with gabby that he wants to have kids and get married like i don't even know how old they are i think they're like 13 at this point and so it makes me feel like Falco may die and I, I, I don't want him to die right because we know our little Falco realized that all of this stuff is really messed up a long while ago Gabby is just not realizing but Falco already realized it. it's just it's just crazy it's so crazy the next episode is called two brothers and I am I feel like it's weird that they're focusing a lot on Aaron walking towards Zeke in this episode like most of the episode like, well, half of the episode, he's, like, just inching towards Zeke. And it, it makes it, it makes it, it makes it kind of weird. Like, I don't know his intent when he gets to Zeke. Like, it kind of feels like he's going to betray him as opposed to work with him. And I don't know if that's how they wanted it to come off to make us, like, suspenseful and, like, oh, like, what's going to happen? Like, they're making this kind of weird. But I'm really excited for the next episode. Next episode will be 78. Make sure you come back here next time to watch with me and check me out on my social media. And thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys. Bye. Oh, 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 oh,